Hi, Jean-Pierre Demange. Uh, you are our VP Sales and Marketing for Calray. Uh, first, in a few words, what is the activity of uh, Calray company? We are one of the few uh, companies in Europe to develop and sell a processor. We are a pioneer in the many core technology, which consists of uh, taking one CPU, optimizing it for uh, computing power and for power consumptions and then duplicating this core many times. In our case, we have up to 256 cores on the same processors. We call it MPPA, which means a massively parallel processor array. Our goal is not to replace an x86, is to accelerate it. Our advantage versus uh, alternative accelerating technologies is that we are programmable, for instance, compared to FPGA, which is purely hardware, or we have a better G, uh, gigaflops per watt ratio versus GPU. Our two main markets, we have two strategic markets. The first one is uh, embedded critical, like avionics or uh, military. And the second one is cloud computing. What is your last investment in HPC? We just received our new uh, processor, called Boston. It's a huge step forward uh, versus the first generation. We have increased the performance by a factor four for FPU in single precision and by a factor six for dual precision. We have integrated 128 cryptography core. We have as well added a smart Ethernet dispatcher. Based on this new processor, we will launch two boards by the end of the year. The first one is the TurboCard 3, which is an accelerating board exhibiting four MPPA on the board, providing 2.5 teraflops performance at 100 watts. This board will accelerate workloads in the HPC for oil and gas, finance, cryptography applications. The second board is the K-ONIC 80, which is a SmartNIC uh, board uh, running at 80 gigabit per second. The current solution today uses ASIC, and it takes up to 12 months to update this board with new protocols, or to implement these new protocols on the main server, and it takes 50% of the time of the x86 to run those protocols. So it's wasting time. In our case, we will be able to implement those new protocol, virtualization protocol like uh, VXLAN, NVGRE, Trill, uh, on the, the board, thanks to a powerful and deterministic architecture of this new processor. And the next step will be to access server storage, uh, remote server storage through the Ethernet fabrics, thanks to implementation of RDME and NVMe protocol. So that's basically the, the investment we have done. Okay, last question, uh, Jean-Pierre Demange. Um, what is your activity in big data sector? Big data is becoming very important and uh, it will require a lot of storage. And that's why we have taken the decision to go in the storage server market. Uh, with Boston, the new processor, we believe we can smash in one processor the network interface card function plus the SSD controller function and adding compression and encryption data on the fly. Having a lot of storage is important, but finding the, in, the right information at the right time is very important as well. There is a new technology called deep learning, where the machine learns and improves by themselves, like the human body network. And there is a famous uh, algorithm called CNN, Convol Convolutional Neural Network, where a, our processor is doing very well. We, are, um, we have a factor four versus GPU in terms of gigaflops per watt. And this is a very good uh, solution. So, in conclusion, we believe Calray is well positioned for the cloud revolution.
Thank you, Jean-Pierre Demange. Thank you. You're welcome.